everyone, I'm Maddie Olin. I live in Colorado, I live on the western slope, and it's finally spring, it's getting warm out, and for most people living in the mountains, that means it's time to go camping, to explore the outdoors, and of course, to hit the road. But not so cool? Gas prices, high maintenance costs, and harmful vehicle emissions. So after all these years living in the mountains, I'm finally starting to consider switching to an EV. But now my question is, can I get everything I love about this car right here, but on an all-electric vehicle? Let's find out. I'm here with Chris at Glenwood Springs Ford. I told him exactly what I'm looking for on my next vehicle, and it looks like he might have the perfect match for me to test drive today. The Mustang Mach-E has great range. It is a fully electric, zero emissions vehicle. For you SUV owners, you want all wheel drive, you want something that's good in the snow, and you want a certain price point. You're able to get them in the same price range that you are buying most of your SUV all wheel drives. I don't know why I had the impression that all electric vehicles were really slow, but it's definitely not the case with this one. This is a fast car. It actually took me a minute to get used to the acceleration and the braking, but now it's driving really smooth. It feels like my everyday car that I drive to work every day. One thing that got me really excited when I was talking to Chris about these electric vehicles is that they have way less moving parts than a conventional engine, right? So there's no engine oil, for example. That means no oil changes, no oil filters, no spark plugs, no air filters. And that means less maintenance, right? That's definitely a big selling point for me. Now I'm at the Glenwood Springs Volkswagen to test drive the ID4. It's another all electric SUV option in the market. And it does check all of my boxes. It is an SUV, there is an all wheel drive option, plenty of cargo space and all the safety features that I'm looking for. One of the things I love the most impressively about the 2021 ID4 when we first got it was the power that the vehicle had, the comfort that it had, the features that it had. Lots of room on the inside, lots of great technology. Super user friendly in my opinion. Massive sunroof on the inside. I mean, it's, just, it's, it's a great vehicle to drive, it's lots of fun. What I really like about both vehicles that I'm driving today is that they both have this smaller screen right in front of me, really minimal with just the information that I need, my speed, my range. This way I don't get distracted by looking down at the center screen because there's a lot going on here. Both the Mustang Mach-E and the Volkswagen ID4 have all the safety features that I'm looking for. You know, lane keeping assistance, stability control, airbags of course, blind spot monitor, and they both have 360 image of the car as well. All right, so I'm done test driving the second EV for the day. I'm not gonna lie, I, I was very intimidated at first. It's a lot of technology, some things that I don't really understand, and it almost feels like I'm driving a computer. But once you start driving, it really is just like any other car, right? You put your foot down and it goes, you put your foot on the brake and it stops. So yeah, get in touch with the local dealership, schedule a time to test drive one of these EVs. This is not something of the future, right? This is something that is available right now. Our small town dealerships have these vehicles available to buy, to lease, to test drive. Make sure to ask the salesperson all your questions, talk about your concerns. So yeah, next time you go to a dealership to buy a brand new car, make sure to test drive an EV option too, even if it's just for fun. You might be surprised, you know, there's some really exciting models out there and even more exciting options to come. We were talking about electric trucks. That to me sounds like a complete game changer. So yeah, who knows, maybe your next car will be electric.